before you got to the most formative years of your life, Potter had already happened. You were globally famous. Um, how do you, do you remember going on your first date? The most, like that yes. rite of passage, I'm curious how you would handle something like that. Yeah, um, yeah, I, we did. I do remember my first date. Uh, well, my first sort of proper date were like taking a girl out to a restaurant or something. Uh, yeah, I, I remember that. I just went out with a, with a cap on and you have to like hope that the person you're dating is like understanding and not like made to feel awkward by like someone coming up or um, anything like that. But you just do it. I mean, that was always the weird thing. People always said, like, I think people always imagined that I like didn't have uh, childhood that I missed out on some stuff and like I'm sure I had a very different childhood but I all those like those first dates and first kisses and all that that those those rites of passage that I still had them and they were actually you know generally really private and I don't feel like I had to share them with the world and I feel like they were really my own which is which is nice would you like to share them all now? No, I'm good. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's Thanks. Good. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody. Don't forget to like this video and leave a comment if you enjoyed it or if you didn't enjoy it. And for more of the Jess Cagle interview, click on the subscribe button down here. We've got plenty of other great videos for you, too. Check them out by clicking on one of these links.